everybody, it's your boy Robbie P2 here, so as always, Robbie P2 family, please. I want everybody using the hashtag Robbie P2 family. So, and let's see here now. Welcome to, well, I'm going to call this uh, a special hashtag mukbang Thursday because it is a collaboration with uh, my friend here. Natural Dory, or Dory Stuky, or actually, I guess better known as Natural Dory. She's uh, doing this as well here. And so for the part of the collaboration, we all decided to get food from... We decided to get the one, I guess the one meat plate with a couple sides and a drink from Dickie's Barbecue, which is also a first on my channel. So let's dig in. See what we got here now. Of course, I got mine delivered from DoorDash, which, by the way, DoorDash late as always. So, and uh, it's, uh, got a meat, two sides, like some bar I guess some barbecue sauce, and I like spend a little extra to get a drink. So. Yeah, I know they advertise this as big yellow cup, but uh, does that really look yellow? It's, uh, it's nice and big, though, but uh, let's see here. And so we decided to get the same options. So we got the. Uh, so let's take a look in here. So we got a dinner roll, and let's see here. Now we got the turkey plate for the one meat item here, but uh, no barbecue sauce. What's up with that, Dickies? No barbecue sauce. So. Here. Uh, ask for sauce, but no sauce. What's up with that? So, turkey does look good though. And we chose the same two items. So, we got the, uh, I think we got the cabbage uh, coleslaw. And we got what am I possibly going to be one of my favorites the mac and cheese. And uh, I'm not sure what she got to drink, but I got the cold pizza sweet tea. So, anyway, let's dig in. So, give us a little review first. So, now. Hmm. Turkey. Nice, roasted. Actually flavored pretty well. Mm. Mm. So probably don't need really need any barbecue sauce, so Let's see. Moist, juicy, definitely seasoned well. I think it's dry rubbed, so. So, good job on this, Dickies. This is great. I'm giving this turkey itself a 9 out of 10. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is like, like Thanksgiving dinner. Maybe instead of sauce, this could maybe use some gravy or something. Mm -mm. And instead of mac and cheese and coleslaw, hey, could have also opted for, well, I wish Dickies, I guess, would have had maybe some uh, 
stuffing, cranberries, and mashed potatoes. Mm. So good, well, good job, Dickies. So, and thank you, Natural Dory, for picking this out as well. So. And yes, this is Dickie's Barbecue Pits, a nice barbecue turkey. So, or on the grill, something like that. Hmm. Hmm. Smoked, I mean. This is lovely. Hmm. Maybe next time, let's see, we can also try like the ribs or the, or like a, any other meats I got. Mm. Chicken, stuff like that. Hey, leave a thumbs up on here if you guys want to see Dickie's Barbecue Pit reappear. Mm. And in case you can't tell, yes, we are doing this in traditional Mukbang Monday style. Mm -hmm. That's it. This is lovely. So. Mm What's got the dinner roll? I think it's a King's Hawaiian roll. Hmm. Fresh baked. It's pretty good. So, 9 out of 10 for the turkey. The roll gets an 8. Mm. So, let's do this coleslaw here. Yes, it's an oil based coleslaw. So, why they gotta do that? So, just like KFC. So, hmm. So, um, Colson gives a little improvement, though, just not make it oil based. That's for sure. Just, you know, just chop up cabbage, put some carrots in there, and, you know, just call them good. Hmm. Mm hmm. A little better than typical restaurant coleslaw, so give them that. Mm. So, I'm gonna give the coleslaw like a 6 out of 10. Because, yeah, I usually don't like these runny coleslaws and all that. So.
I mean, coleslaw does taste all right. Could use some improvement, so. But hey, get that Dory likes the cold sauce, so that's awesome. So, <laughs> all right, here we go. Tea could be a little sweeter, but hey, that's uh, that's gold peaks for you. So. All right, and then now, probably going to be my favorite side of these two, the mac and cheese. So, let's dig in here. It's got the elbow macaroni with the cheese sauce. Mm -hmm. So, it's a little tasty. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10, because like, it kind of tastes like it was pre-made, not made in the store. Mm -hmm. so, something like that. Well, tastes better than, like, you know, the pre-made canned stuff. But I'll give them that, and then again in the store, so I'll give them that, though. So, uh, seven out of ten for the let's see, so seven, seven out of ten for the uh, mac and cheese, six out of ten for the coleslaw, eight for the uh, eight for the uh, roll, nine for the turkey in the main course, and I guess. Uh, and we're not even gonna judge the drink because that's the same everywhere. So I paid like fourteen twenty nine before tax for, well, you know, just for the food and then extra, extra couple dollars for the drink. With a nice reusable cup, thanks, Dickies. But wouldn't really call it yellow, unless, unless, unless you're talking about that logo, but uh. A little suggestion for Dickies, like, like, uh, let's see, I know, big yellow cup, but, uh, you know, don't have somebody colorblind advertising it, so. <laughs> so, let's see. Six, seven, eight, nine. So, I figured I'm gonna just give this meal all together for the price. I feel like we got eight out of ten. So, Dickies could have maybe included a little bit of sauce to maybe help elevate the turkey, because I did order some barbecue sauce with it here. Um, coleslaw, yeah, that shouldn't be that runny, it shouldn't be runny or anything like that. I think it's just be like, you know, fresh chopped vegetables, something like that. Uh, if there's any dressing, yeah, that should be on the side, so. And, uh, mac and cheese, hey, that was pretty good, but, uh, I'm just saying, side, uh, only improvement I'll have for the sides is they would be a lot better if they were actually made in the store, so. And I say the same thing for, like, all the other, all the other fast food chains as well, like, say, KFC, Popeyes, um, and, you know, all, all the other chicken places, you know, so. All right. So, 
And of course, again, this is a collaboration with my, with Dory Stuckey, aka Natural Dory. So I will have a link to her channel with a video down below. Everybody, please go check her out. And you know, go check her out her you know her version. And you know, go support her channel as well. You know, and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already for her. You know, ring her notification bell. Watch at least two minutes of her other content as well. You know, give her comments and thumbs ups and tell her I sent you. And then, hey, do the same, you know, feel free to do the same for me, you know. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Watch at least two minutes of other content. Leave comments and thumbs ups. And all that stuff here. And keep that support going around. And you know, hopefully many more collaborations will uh, Hopefully get to do more collaborations here. So, um, for those who want to want to do a collab, please, uh, you know, send your request to RobbieP2Vlogs at gmail.com. It's all there in the About section of the tab, or you can um, About tab of my channel. Or, you can also add me on, you know, private message me on Instagram at RobbieP2 underscore vlogs. So, I just ask, do not, uh, uh, I mean, if you guys put the comment, put a request anywhere else, I don't pay attention to that stuff. So, put in the comments. That's no guarantee of anything. So, in a nutshell, that means I just don't want to see in the comments. I'd rather see a private message. So, all right, uh, and uh, that's about it here. So, and as always, I mean, well, let's, let me actually consolidate all this, make an easy cleanup. So, since of course I have to provide my own utensils. Uh, and napkins and all that. So there we go. So that's it. And thank you for watching. And as always, be happy, be safe, be positive. Your boy, Robbie P2, out.